Welcome back to another video. This is just a short one. We've got some stuff that I wanted to mention, which was posted on Twitter. First of all, is this image right here. For those of you who play AQ Worlds, this might look familiar. This is the Primal Hanzo Void. This arrived back in 2019 for Nogath's birthday. This is what the full set looked like, and these were the pieces of the stuff that we got with it. But yeah, it was a really awesome armor set. And it looks like this is coming to AQ3D. In other news, we're getting a secret spooky release on Thursday, which takes inspiration from a very popular game with very popular monsters. And this... The, the only spooky game I can think of that's really popular is Five Nights at Freddy's. I have played this game before. It is terrifying. I'm definitely interested to see if this is what that secret spooky release is going to be inspired by. And if it is, I'm interested to know what direction they're going to go with it. Like, I'm, how are they going to do that in AQ3D? I don't know. Anyways, it's going to be really interesting. Can't wait to see what it actually is because right now that's just a theory based on the fact that it is a spooky game and it's got monsters in it. In other news, we have a golden armor set reward. This sounds interesting. I'm really not sure what that's going to be, but I mean, anything golden I always look forward to. We also have a gold boost and this is going to be starting on thursday and it's going to run until next thursday so that's great if you guys have been running low on some gold it'll be a great time to start farming over the weekend and whatnot we've also says last chance to get the october promo item because that's going to be disappearing next week so if you've been wanting to get it make sure to purchase some of those dragon crystals or guardian or something so you can get that promo item it is a really cool item i actually really do like the october promo item and next we have the new november promo item which is going to be arriving next week of course replacing the october one and so we have nogath finale the week after i'm super excited for that it's been delayed a lot i know there's i've seen things on twitter and, I, and other people have talked about how it's been constantly delayed but it might be worth it, especially considering what we got. And I will say the recent, I mean, the last update we got with the whole Raven Spire, that was very, very cool. And I hope that, you know, because of that, we do have potential that it's what, we, what we're going to be getting for the Nogath finale could be really, really cool. So hopefully we'll have to wait and see. And then we got an in-game mail system in the works. That is really exciting. I'm also looking forward to that. I love when new features come into the game. Also, inventory changes up on the PTR. So if you guys had seen my recent video on that, I have another video coming out actually later today, which is also showcasing more of the inventory things in relation to the bank. But that is it for the news. I'd like to know what you guys think the special spooky release is going to be taking inspirations from do you think it is five nights at freddy or do you think it's another popular game that maybe one i don't know of i was also thinking like among us but that doesn't have any monsters so and it's not very scary so i don't know if you guys have any other ideas of what you think it might be let me know in the comments below and if you think it is five nights at freddy also post i'd like to see how many people are thinking the same as me we're going to have to wait until Thursday to find out who's right. And that is it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one.